Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions Crystal Opening. So if you haven't heard already, the solo events have gotten an upgrade. Uh, they've upgraded the rewards, and they got a little bit of a change in how you get the points. So let's take a look at the current solo event. So as you can see, I already got all the milestones, but look at how you get points. So if you remember the old tech combat, you only got points for just basically using the champion or the class that they specified. So in this case, all you would have seen on the old tech combat is this here, okay? Win a fight using a one star, two star, three star, all the way up to the six star. But you now have a little bonus. If you use a tech champion to win a fight with a special one, you'll get extra points. Now they did have events like this before and I'm happy to see that they've combined them. So now, and it's random, it might be a heavy attack, it might be a special one, two, three, it might be a medium attack or a light attack. Uh, but whatever it is, always take a look to see if you can get some extra bonus points so you can get the points faster. All right, now let's take a look at the rewards. So these are the milestone rewards, okay? Uh, not too impressive if you are an endgame player here so far, all right? But look at that last one. Now, the reason that I always did the tech combat before and get all the milestones, or not just tech combat, but the combat events was for that final milestone, which gave you a 10% uh, boost. And those can be very useful, especially when you are uh, in war and you don't want to boost up really big, but you might just want that little extra. Well, now it's a 15% boost, not a 10% boost, which is a very nice increase. And you get four star uh, signature stones. Now at my level, uh, those aren't going to be extremely helpful, but because I am who I am, I like to max out my four stars signature. Most of them are already maxed out, but this is going to help me max them out uh, even further when I get a new champion or anything like that. Uh, I'll be able to do that. I'll probably wait until there's an item use event on and then I'll end up using them there. All right. So that's awesome. Now take a look at the ranked rewards and we're going to be opening up a, a bunch of these. Okay. Um, for the top one to 10%, notice that there is no rank one, two, three. It's just percentage based. Okay, you get four of these Supreme Solo Crystals and we're gonna open up uh, these guys. You get this Greater Cavalier Rank Up Selector. People were asking, what is that? Well, we're gonna check that out today. And you get more four star Signature Stones. Now, given how easy it is to get the rank rewards, I don't think that's too bad. Okay, 11 to 20%, you get the same things just in lesser amounts. 21 to 40 now, uh, you only get two of these uh, Supreme Solo Crystals and you get two of these four Signature Stone Crystals. So not a generic, but now a random, all right? And then you get one of each here. And then at the bottom, you only get these uh, solo crystal shards, which for 10,000, you'll get one of those crystals. Okay, so a very nice little uh, boost, especially for progressing players, uh, but I like it as well. So let's go to my mail. And because I'm an arena grinder, I'm probably gonna end up more often than not ranking fairly high. So let's take a look at the Cosmic Arena Battle. And as you can see, I ranked, you know, in that one to 10%. So let's go ahead and claim that and we're gonna open those. All right, so this is the Greater Cavalier Rank Up Selector. Uh, I'm glad I did that because I wasn't sure whether it would go in my inventory and then allow me to select it later. But as you see, as soon as I claimed it, it popped this up. So bear that in mind. This is what we have to select from. Tier four basic uh, catalyst fragments, uh, tier four class catalyst fragment crystals, and four star signature stone crystals. Um, 
I like T4 basics, but I also need uh, tier four class catalysts to uh, rank up my guys. So probably that one is going to be the best one for me. So this is the first time I'm seeing this, but I'm, I'm loving what I'm seeing here. Okay, let's uh, delete, go to the next one. Okay, so that was the mystic one. And it doesn't say it, but you know from the rewards from the last time, this is one to 10%. Let's claim that. And we're gonna go ahead with the same one. All right. Those are gonna be the most useful for me. Now, hero use, uh, you can see I also scored one to 10%. I probably will always get one to 10% in hero use because I grind that arena so very much. And I just play often. I, I do the monthly event quests and everything. So I'm probably going to score pretty high because I, I'm playing the game a lot. All right. So you get these uncollected golden crystals like I need gold. Uh, then you get five more of these supreme solo crystals. You get this greater solo crystal, five of them. And you get a tier four class catalyst crystal. I was spending glory to get these things so that I would have more to be able to rank up my guys. Um, I need more skill. I'm trying to save uh, my skill, at least 13 of them, in case I get Aegon, I can rank him up. But I need to start ranking these guys up. All right, so let's go ahead and uh, claim that. And here's the arena wins again, one to 10%. Again, a bunch of these uh, Supreme Solo Crystals. Uh, same stuff. So I'm, I'm actually really liking this a lot. It is a very nice upgrade. Okay, and that's just since we've uh, started. Now, I'm going for a champion, so I'm probably grinding the arena a bit more than uh, I normally would. But not that much more. All right, so let's go ahead and start popping these guys open. So we can see what we get in here. All right, let's claim that. All right, so we have four of those. We'll open those up some other time. All right, I'm not even sure where those guys, uh, I know in the special we have the Supreme ones, um, but I'm just checking to make sure none of the others came over here. I don't think they did. Um, but I want to just make sure there might be something that I forgot. Um, that's how I end up hoarding so many. See how many five-star crystals, uh, uh, five-star signature stone crystals I have? I can't open them because I'm maxed out on uh, my mutant. All right, so let's go ahead over here to the uh, solo ones. These are the ones that they converted for me, the greater solo uh, crystals up at the top, uh, 1,152. We're not going to open those up right now. Um, but here are the Supreme Solo Crystals. Those are the ones I'm, I'm curious. Now, I might start hoarding those up as well uh, a little bit later. But for right now, I want to, you know, for this first batch, I want to check them out. All right. So we've got 18 of those. So let's go ahead and we're going to, we're not going to spin all of them out. But we're going to spin a few and then pop. All right, so let's go ahead and tap that. You can see what we're getting in here. Um, some pretty nice prizes, definitely better. And that's what we used to get for the uh, combat. So that's nice. Um, let's spin out another one here. So yeah, I'm, I'm liking these uh, upgraded rewards. These, uh, oh, and something else that I, I didn't mention earlier, but these are now progression based. So if you don't see the same options, then that means you're probably not Cavalier. Maybe you're just uncollected. Uncollected gets different. I don't know what all they get. Um, but, you know, for the solo events, it is um, now progression based. All right. What do we got? Ooh, which kind of crystal is that? Okay, four star awakening gem crystal. Not bad. Uh, save me a grind, perhaps. Uh, when I go for champions, I'll sometimes just go once and then I'll do something else. So 
if it comes out to be a class that I need uh, someone awakened on, perfect. All right, let's go ahead and uh, go that, and we'll, we'll spin out a few more, and then we will pop the last uh, 10. All right, which crystal is that? All right, plus five signature stone, not bad. That's gonna help out, uh, help me max out my uh, four star signatures even faster. All right, let's see what we got. Wouldn't mind that four star uh, generic awakening gem. Okay, I'll take that too. Looks like I'm gonna be uh, maxing those guys out pretty easily. I like it. it. Means I'll start using them more often. All right, let's see. What we got. Oh, okay. Arena boost. I will take that. Five star arena boost. Oh, yeah. Well, um, when I'm going for a champion, and if I feel like I need to put that little extra oomph, I will start busting out my uh, uh, crystals for these uh, boosts. And having them right off the bat is great. Okay? I'll take that as well. Very, very nice. Um, I usually end up opening up a bunch of my crystals uh, when I'm going for a champion and I want to boost. Uh, which I don't do very often. In fact, uh, I've done it only maybe three times. And I end up opening up a bunch of them just to try to get uh, the classes I need and uh, just to get a five star. And then whatever class, that's the class I'll start using to boost and refresh. All right, what do we got here? Okay, another 10 percenter. Attack and health boost. All right, last one will spin and then we'll pop the last 10. Um, but keep in mind, this is only, you know, the few events that I've gotten. I'm going to be getting a lot of these. But I wanted to do this first time uh, opening so we can kind of get a feel for what these guys look like. Okay, another boost. I will take it and it's a cosmic. So if I ever end up using that, I'll be able to use that with Corvus. And Corvus is fast already, so that is actually a really good one. All right, let's go ahead and pop the last 10. What do we got? All right, so we got uh, the 10%, uh, we got five of the uh, attack and health, two science, one cosmic, got one of these four star awakening gem crystals. We got four of the um, signature plus fives, so that's really nice. Got some health boost. Ooh, and we've got a four-star awakening generic, which I said I really would love to get. So that's going to help me out um, awaken pretty much anyone that I want to that I feel the need to. All right, so that's actually not bad. Uh, that's going to do it for this video, guys. Let me know what you think about these rewards. Uh, are you liking the upgraded rewards and the upgraded uh, solo events. I am. Now, I don't know what's gonna happen with that event quest completion, uh, whether they did away with it or if they got it converted. We haven't seen it come up yet. Um, it's a level up right now, but we haven't seen the event quest completion come up since they have changed it over. It was going on while they changed it, but I'm curious to see if it's gonna be um, easier to complete because uh, that has those units, so I really want to get those units. You know, that's the only thing uh, that I really wanted out of that. But I want to see what the upgraded uh, rewards are for the uh, event quest uh, completion. But that's going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching. Click like, subscribe, leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about the video. And you all have a blessed day.